Hi everybody. I don't really know what to say to start videos anymore. It'll probably just stick with hello or hey. Or if I'm feeling fucking wild, it's gonna be a howdy. Uh, don't worry though, we're not in the twilight zone just yet, my kitties. No, but really, hello again. I'm sorry I keep coming in and... Like Haley's Comet, just kind of passing by every few years. Except I think I might upload a little more frequently than Haley's Comet is observed from Earth's surface, I guess. That's the only way you can see a comet. It doesn't fucking matter. I don't, I don't know enough about science. Maybe you can. Whatever. That's not the point. The point is, hello again. Uh, this won't be the last video I upload for two years, maybe? I don't know. But if I schedule this right, this should be uploading on my channel's ninth birthday. Yeah, I was just checking my social blade on the day of recording this. And I realized, oh shit, I'm a goddamn old man now. And it really got me to reflect on things. I'm not making this video because of that. I've wanted to make this video for a while. I was just kind of waiting for a good time. And then I realized that, well, I'm some C tier, according to Social Blade. C tier. Check me out, ladies. YouTuber. Who, uh, you know, kind of hasn't uploaded shit in a while. And I felt bad about that. And I actually really do enjoy editing videos, too. They're, like, that's a lot of fun for me. It's just nice to sit down, you get a project going, and then you, you know get to watch it afterwards and see all your hard work kind of come together and uh so yeah that brings us to the main topic where i've been what i've been doing uh honestly the answer is really dull it's just work and working out that's about it i've just been constantly working because i fucking love money Apart from that, I work out now, which is something I've always wanted to do, but because I've been so just cripplingly terrified of social situations. I'm sure some armchair psychologist can pick at that for like three days and just be like, Well, that's because of your innate fear of clowns. Hmm. Uh, no. I've kind of come to like clowns. As a matter of fact, I kind of identify with them now. Some would say I am a clown. Oh, they don't mean that as a compliment. No, but... Yeah. So, that was kind of a big thing for me. Uh, a lot of things in my life have just been me being afraid of it. And then just being like... Eh, fuck it, I'm self-destructive at this point, so... I may as well jump into it. That's the worst that happens, I die. <laughs> nah. That's not really my thinking now. My thinking is a lot has a, matured a lot. But back when I was in my late teens, probably, I just hated my life. I wanted to die. Uh, which, you know, having depression is never fun. I still have it. Like, sometimes it, you know, gets bad. But it is nowhere near as bad as it was when I was younger. When I was young, I was fucking scrawny. I hated it. I hated a whole lot of things in my life. I didn't get to see my friends much, or at all. Uh, and then eventually I felt like they hated me. Which might be true. I don't know. I don't care really. I have a new set of friends. Which, that's good advice for you guys out there. If you're worried about, you know, not seeing your friends or whatever. Uh, if they end up hating you, it's okay. If you've made one friend, you can make more. That's a very important thing to know. And I think a lot of people forget about that. But it's just... That's how it goes, man. If you've ever made a single friend in your life, could be in kindergarten, you can make more. Unless you're like... Someone who eats shit... For fun. Your, your range of friends and quality of them is gonna be very slim. I'm not gonna lie to you, you're gonna befriend only other shit eaters. So maybe try to keep that subdued. If you wanna make friends outside of that very narrow circle. Okay, uh, 
I don't think this will ever be monetized, which kind of sucks because I like money. But that's fine, I'm making like three pennies on the dollar. Anyway, no, that's not the whole reason I'm here. Apart from working out to be bigger, it also helped my confidence. I, you know, I gained more weight, which was healthy because I was criminally underweight at the time. And I'm still kind of struggling with that. I keep fluctuating between a range of 10 pounds. Right now I'm at like 133 or something. I'm only 5'6", so don't worry, kids. I'm very, very short. Please love me. <laughs> no, uh... Also, I'm 23. I don't think I mentioned that. Um, I'm just blowing your mind left and right today. You know, everyone... For a while, people thought I was like this fucking 40-year-old man or something. I got that a lot. Uh, yeah, man. Modern Warfare 2 lobbies, I would get that shit talk all the fucking time. Uh, people have mistaken me as a, for a black man. For some reason, I don't really know how the hell anyone came to that conclusion, but I've gotten that before. Uh, that's about it. <laughs> yeah, those, those two things, that's literally it. I think some people think I ham up my voice. I don't. I'm just this monotone. That's about it. I feel like I've said that already. Well, anyway, yeah. So, now that we have some basic facts about me laid out, uh, apart from having, having crippling depression, it's not really crippling at this point. I can still, it's functional depression, we'll say. <laughs> I can be depressed and still go to work. As a matter of fact, some people would say those two things are one and the same. <laughs> I want to die. But yeah, uh, social anxiety. I feel like I will make a video on that another time. As a matter of fact, yeah, fuck yeah, I will. Because I have a lot to say about it, just from personal experiences. Um, I, I, this is the second time I'm recording this. And the first one was a lot more bleak, and I kind of went into weird topics that I don't feel like I want to go into now. I guess I should explain the gameplay. Uh, this is just some Halo Reach gameplay. Uh, I was I just fucking really love Halo Reach, and when I saw it was coming to PC and the Master Chief Collection, I was like, fuck yeah, dude. I want to play that shit right now. I never got to max rank. And then I just jumped into a random Team Slayer lobby and I saw I think a th I think three people on the enemy team were max rank which is inheritor and I was like oh shit I'm gonna get my ass pushed in aren't I uh turns out that's not what happened it's spoilers but yeah uh and then that kind of gave me an idea like you know, max rank doesn't mean shit in a video game. You can be max rank and be shitty and just quit out of lobbies. It doesn't really... I'm sure that applies to life somehow, but I can't wax philosophically on that right now. I just want to gush about how awesome Halo Reach was and is. The community for this game is pretty cool. Uh, unless you unless you play Griff Ball. Then you're just going to run into assholes or boosters uh, those are not always one and the same but sometimes they are god forbid you try to play a genuine match of griff ball in xbox 360 halo reach they'll fucking spawn trap you and your entire team will leave and you will remain spawn fucked the entire match it's like being in prison. I hate it. But sometimes, sometimes, you wind up in, like, a lobby where they just boost. And then you get to do, uh, do frog jumps over people. What the fuck is it called? Leapfrog. You get to leapfrog over the enemy team. And then it's like a unified existence and everyone's happy. 
So I guess that's kind of like a meta game in Griffball. So this should be winding down soon ish, like in another minute or so. So I guess I'll just get to my closing points. Thank you all for sticking around. My subscribers really haven't fluctuated at all. Probably because most people just have inactive accounts or have just, you know, been true homies and stuck with me. They were like, man, this motherfucker used to upload Fallout 3 videos with a shaky cam that was diagonal on a TV that had a massive burn in it. And I'm still hopeful he'll go back to making those quality videos. Don't worry, kids. I'm not going back there. Fuck that noise. That was terrible. But, uh, yeah. Yeah. I want to upload more. And I'm not just saying that. I genuinely find this fun. I'll go into One more details right. on, like, stories and whatnot I have. Because I have a few. And some topics I want to maybe rant about or just discuss. Kind of use this as a journal. Not really, but I, I would like to, you know, get back into the swing of things. This is more so just a, hey, I'm alive sort of thing. I haven't killed myself yet, so that's always cool. No, we're not about that anymore. Or any less. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, apart from that, glorious message of confidence and uh, peace, love, positivity, all that jazz. Uh, hope you guys have fun. Have a good day. Uh, by the time this goes up, my channel will be nine years old. And uh, it's fucking wild to think about, man. I started this when I was 14. Anyway, thanks for watching, fellas. Hope you all have a great night.